So here we go. Look, I mean, I, I don't know why companies do this. Uh, well, so companies don't normally do it. I can all those. They're, they're the conductors, right from the pickups individually go into there well from the switch all the wiring's back to front i hate it when people do this this would just be one conductor there and that's coming from the output of the switch i hate it when they do all this so now i've got a load of fucking no that's bad okay so what so there's either two ways doing this I, I can either rewire it properly the out to the output take this this is, this is in effect a pickup wire it's like a, a four conductor with the ground like, you know so uh, I could I could have done that but if it was working before it come to me and it just had issues I, I've just um, I've just re made good the way it was so, that saves me rewiring all that fucking mess. So, sorry for swearing, bollocks. Um, yeah, so, before it wasn't making, it wasn't making a noise. So, let's see. Oh, God, I can't do this. Holding the phone. Stand by. Oh, that's it. Oh, moment of truth. Oh, yeah. That makes a noise. So all we've got to do now is set it up. The electrics are working. Let's have a go. So the electrics are all done. They're all uh, working again now. This is all covered up, ready for me to have a, a quick uh, whiz over the frets. The fretboard's all oiled now. Well, it's part of oil. And uh, the pickups are covered. I'll show you why in a sec. But uh, all the machine heads have been tightened, and the uh, the screws, <laughs> the tuning heads, the knobs that have uh, all been retightened to a uniform tightness. Okay, that's a uniform tightness. Oh, have you seen this drum? Look at this. 1960s Premier Royal Ace that's uh, been restored. That's going back to its owner soon. See, Mark's Naughty Drums. 